They care about getting their homes back together. They care about putting their lives back together. And that shouldn't be a Democratic or Republican thing. That should be an American thing. Eight months after Hurricane Laura, calls for disaster relief continue in Lake Charles. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Jim Hummel. And I'm Marcel Fontenot. It was last August when Lake Charles was hit by Hurricane Laura and then Delta two months later. It was a devastating season for that city and Mayor Nick Hunter says there has been a lack of urgency at the federal level. Threes on the street tonight, Armand Boyd reports from Lake Charles on what the mayor hopes will be done. Lake Charles Mayor Nick Hunter says that the city hasn't received any FEMA assistance or for Congress to pass a relief package. He says his disappointment in the response goes across party lines. President Trump with the 116th Congress had an opportunity to act. And now President Biden with the 117th Congress has an opportunity. The individual that is suffering here in Lake Charles who still has their life torn apart by this event couldn't care one iota whether it was a Republican or a Democrat that passed a disaster relief package. In his Facebook post, Lake Charles Mayor Nick Hunter details what he calls a lack of urgency and adds perspective to previous disaster responses. Such a, an action happened 10 days after Hurricane Katrina, I believe 34 days after Hurricane Andrew. The governor's federal aid request for hurricane recovery totals $3 billion. Mayor Hunter says the city of Lake Charles alone would need an upwards of $250 million just for housing. I'm trying to be a, a microphone for individuals that don't have that type of platform. So I'm going to continue to do all I can to make sure that people do not forget about what has happened here in Lake Charles and what is continuing to happen here in Lake Charles. During President Biden's visit here in Lake Charles, the mayor says that they had a conversation about disaster relief. He says that he would give an update within the coming months if that conversation was beneficial. Threes on the street in Lake Charles, Iman Boyd, KTC TV3.